some of the things that we're looking to do when the money comes in is uh, providing child care, um, providing opportunities for first-time home buyers through our down payment uh, assistance and closing cost assistance program. We also have our homelessness response uh, program through for kids. Uh, we have a broad variety of uh, projects. Our city project, for example, is um, um, through our public utilities department. Uh, we've developed a water and sewer connection fee assistance program to assist um, eligible households to connect to the city's water and main um, water and sewer mains. Uh, we also have an exciting new project um, through the Chesapeake Supportive um, Housing Organization um, where they are renovating the parking lot of the Sanderlin apartment complex and they're also renovating the um, heating and AC units in the, in the apartment complex. So we um, help fund activities from affordable child care to the construction of affordable homes to uh, case management for supportive services for individuals um, that faced uh, homelessness at one point in time. We appreciate and we welcome all uh, input, comments, feedback from our draft annual action plan. So we have just started our public comment period from um, this past Wednesday, um, this past Monday, all the way to May 18th. It's a 30-day public comment period. So we're asking the public to read that draft document um, look through the various sections, uh, our proposed activities to be very specific and uh, to be able to um, give us comments, give us feedback so that we can integrate those f the feedback into the document, prepare it, make it better and uh, submit that to HUD so that we can get funding for the new program year to do some of those things.